What's up, you guys? It's Steve and Leo. What's up? With Everyday Gaming Society and Leo are doing Mortal Kombat, finally. Nice change from Crisis. Yes, finally, finally. And that's an achievement behind that uh, little gameplay there, or the little uh, screens there on the bottom of the screen. But R is right, D is down, R is right, of course, Y. And touching means they have to be touching within the distance. Right, left, down, down for Liu Kang, press A, and then you have to be in the sweep distance. So just so you guys know, it's uh, changed out from the other side. So right is forward, left is away from the character, down is down, up is up. So it's a little confusing at first, but just play with it and have fun with it. Practice and, you know, it's a good time. Enjoy some fake tallies. We don't have all of the characters unlocked, but I just figured I'd give you guys this little clip just to show you guys. Uh, ooh. Yeah. <laughs> They've gotten more brutal since the first one. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah. Graphics have improved a little bit. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, but we don't have all of them unlocked. This is just to show you guys the gist of uh, you know the main characters. So play through and get the unlockables and enjoy it, definitely. Look at that. Sub-Zero. And could you imagine dying like that? You know, again, like half your body froze and then the other half ripped off? Yeah. Um, oh, look at this one. I love this one. Oh, it's going to freeze. No. There we go. Oh. Oh. It's a slow motion now. Look <laughs> yeah. at that. We got a little, uh, <laughs> like a little bit of lag going on right flawless now. Flawless victory. Yeah. You're very good at this game. You keep getting flawless victories. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I just got another controller and it's just there on my lap so it doesn't do anything. That's what I was thinking. Yeah. Boom. Yeah. Just that like, is... Yeah. Dead Space has nothing on this for a gruesome. I, I can't stand Dead Space playing it. It freaks the crap out of me. It really does. It is. I mean, it is a it is a scary game. Uh, I used to think... Uh, hold up, I gotta see this now. Well, what's he gonna do? He's gonna puke in his mouth. That's a little gay. And then... Yep. Right like that. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah, well, there you go. Yeah, it's, I think it's his stomach. Who was that? Who was that? Uh, that was Ermac. Okay, Ermac. Okay. Ermac. But yeah. No, this game is actually pretty fun. It's uh, it's a lot different than, you know, the old school Ooh. ones. And I like this one a lot better than Combat vs. DC. I just thought it was way too slow. I, I don't know. Mm -hmm. I like button mashing like the old school ones, just going crazy on it. Yeah, well, you know... They needed a gimmick for that one, and it was, you know, it was all right. They didn't have quite enough characters as this one, so they really went back to oh, oh, uh, oh. oh. <laughs> yeah. no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> 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 That's just the video. That's just the video that likes, not us. So. Touching. Yeah, it's got to be touching the character when you do this button sequence. Okay. So, and like when it says full screen, there you need to be all the way on the other side, just because you're gonna be throwing an object or something. Gotcha. Just like that, you know. And, yep, cut the head. I see why this is banned in Australia. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you can see that too, huh? Man. So, uh, did you finish the story? Uh, no, actually, I got uh, to a couple guys on the like last part of the ladder, and I had to go to work, so sure. I had to shut it off, so, man. And uh, what do you think of the story? Ed, I, I don't really follow the story much. I mean, I didn't really follow the story when I played it. I just played the old school ladder, so you start at the bottom, oh. and then you have to work your way up to the top and all that. Gotcha. So, I mean, I heard the story's pretty good, but, you know, I guess when I'm playing Mortal Kombat, I just think of it as kill the R guy and, you know, make it look as grotesque as possible. Right. I never knew I never knew there was a story to it until I read an article about, you know, what was going on and what you needed to know and all that stuff, but... I just treated it as a fighting game. I think I only did verses on it and the ladder and all that stuff. So yeah, exactly. You know, that's how it used to be. Mm -hmm. This is pretty cool. Who is that new bot? Um, no, I think that's Cy Cybrex. Let me check my sheet here. Yep, Cybrex ones. No, I just posted. Oh, uh, Cyrex. Say, yeah, oh, did it? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> okay. So you know, at the end of every battle, you know, it says who wins and all that stuff. So who's this? This is Noob, I believe. This is Noob Bot. Okay. Look at this. Ah, oh, the that parts is... falling. Oh my god. It's awesome. <laughs> I gotta try that. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> yeah, I don't think that's legal in MMA. But maybe in Canada MMA, but it, it might be. Yeah. Uh, it's pretty crazy, blowing smoke and he just like slowly disintegrates. 
man. Imagine having this job where you get paid to think of all this stuff. Uh, There's some messed up people that work for this company. <laughs> I got to tell you, man, you got to have some weird dreams at night or rough type sleeping playing this sure. kind of stuff, you know, day in and day out, but... Here we go. What's he going to do? Ooh. One, two, three, four. That was pretty neat. Sector. Flawless victory. Now, is there any uh, achievements for flawless victory or anything like that? Uh, yes. I think it's five gamer score achievement. And it's just to uh, complete it. You can do it like how I did. Have a controller just sitting there and it's a quick five gamer score. And, um, yeah. I mean, it's pretty simple. That's the only achievement I got in so far. Yeah, you know, I just really need to start playing the games more. Sure. I need to stop working, Leo. Well, you gotta pay bills, so, <laughs> you know. Yeah, I know. Um, so, yeah, there you go. There's another achievement. You know, it's an achievement with another achievement on this one, so. Except there's an achievement for doing every fatality, right? Correct? Am I correct? Um, I, I believe so, but oh. I don't have all the characters unlocked, so I, I don't have it yet. But you gotta play the story mode. Yeah, I know. I, I gotta play it. But we got uh, some Portal 2 coming up. Not in this video, of course, but you know, a couple other videos. We're gonna have some Portal 2, some walkthrough achievements, and you know, we'll, that fun stuff. We'll find the cake. Find the cake. Never played Portal 1? No. Ah, oh, so you don't get the joke. No. Is the cake a lie? If people who like Portal, they'll know what I'm talking about. Right. Okay. Probably, you're probably gonna get some mean comments now. Oh yeah, some hatred. <laughs> you shouldn't play the second one until you played the first one. <laughs> Portal's one of the best games alive. <laughs> actually, I was actually um, over at Blockbuster, because it's sadly not that's where I get my games right now, and Gamefly. But, um, yeah, I was going through, and I was talking with the lady behind the counter, and she said that someone actually is having a wedding based off a of Portal. So they're having like, a bunch of the robot characters made out in like, ice sculptures. and. Is this Nate? Is Nate finally marrying his laptop? Is this what's going on? <laughs> no. No, if anything, Nate will marry a donut shop. But. <laughs> or both. <laughs> a, compu <laughs> a computer donut. <laughs> uh, we love you, Nate. <laughs> uh, God, I'm picking on him so much now. Yeah, just wait till he sees you next time. He won't see me. I'm gonna, uh, I hide out, you know. Oh, he, no, he'll find you. <laughs> <laughs> he will find where you live. Uh, but, uh, yeah, it's interesting. A Portal 2 wedding. Yeah, yeah, uh... It's got to be pretty strange, but I, I know I've seen pictures of the Halo 3 wedding on you know Google, so mm -hmm. that, was, that was pretty cool, actually. Well, one one couple married at a White Castle. Really? So Yeah, because of the royal wedding, and they thought, well, we're going to get married in, in a castle, so they got married at White Castle, and they had their whole, they had their wedding there, and uh, for food, you know, you had the onion rings and the White Castle burgers and all that stuff, so. Wow. Yeah. Jeez. So, no, you know. I, I guess I learn something new or hear about something new every day, right? Yeah, I mean, that's wild, but that's probably going to end in divorce, I'm going to guarantee it. Eh, you never know. <laughs> Love comes in all shapes and sizes. Well, yeah, sure. And who's this? Who's this uh, lovely young lady? It's going to say at the end. Lovely young lady? <laughs> you really don't know who Shiva is? Oh, Shiva, okay. Yeah. All right, guys, well, that does it for us. There was over 20 characters, I believe. And, yeah, thanks for watching. Please subscribe. we got more videos coming up soon for this.